Hey everybody, what's going on? No Miss J in the building. I uh, just wanted to come in. Uh, I was trying to drop this video earlier, but the adults not going to sleep. Uh, so, uh, you know, breaking news. The well, it's not so breaking now, but yeah, breaking news. The Pistons went ahead and made a move that I'm very happy with, and that's uh, getting or adding or signing, I should say, um, Markeith Morris, which is interesting. You know, we used to have his brother Marcus Morris, his twin. Uh, years ago, and I was very upset that we let him go. But now we signed six foot ten, power uh, power four center hybrid Marquise Morris. And I should got, I got to say, although he has been battling injury over the past season and his numbers have been kind of down, I'm actually kind of excited about this move. Not because it's a Morris brother, but due to the fact of the matter, now um, he'll probably more likely be used uh, in a lot of situations between center or power four, one way or another. I don't know if they'll play Don there at center and put him in power or play him at center. Uh, obviously, he'll probably be there for scoring reasons. I think if he can stay healthy, his numbers can kind of push back up. Uh, he could be a big help. At this point, uh, I guess just obvious, we more than likely, because we used the biannual uh, uh, signing situation or our biannual series, which is we used most of that $3.6 million we had, uh, if not all of it. And... I mean, for him, I said it's not bad. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, we was hoping that we can get JaVale McGee. But I had heard stories that JaVale McGee was uh, looking to get maybe a $9 million deal for a season. And I know the Pistons were trying to tempt him to maybe possibly go lower or meet him somewhere in the middle. Uh, so maybe the deal just didn't get done. You know, I like, had, had a lot of fans like in the middle of the whole JaVale McGee thing. Some were okay, great with it. Some didn't. Uh, but Markeith Morris, I'll settle for it. You know, again, I'm just happy Zaza don't have to be the primary uh, on this team. If he's even here for some reason that year, which he shouldn't be, uh, I'll just literally pull my hair off. Uh, Zaza should not be coming back in a Pistons uniform by any chance. So I'm actually cool with Markeith Morris signing. Uh, again, it's nothing sexy, but it's darn show needed. So now we can focus on what we all want to focus on, that summer league. Uh, starting this Friday, uh, you know, hopefully, and, it, you know, it's going to be fun to watch it, you know, so next week, <clears throat> I believe on Pistons Center Court, we're going to have a lot of stuff to discuss, uh, while the uh, mishaps of free agency, and, you know, then the summer league games, and uh, the trades, and where quiet is going to go, we're going to have a lot of topics, and I can't wait to get to that uh, point, where we talk about it, man, but Markeith Morris, man, uh, I think he could actually be a bigger help for us than we think. I'm really hoping he can. Uh, this is really an underrated signing, man. I really like it. I know a lot of people may be on the fence about it. I know a lot of people are on the fence about a lot of the signings we made. But I'm going to do a video maybe sometime tomorrow explaining why this was all meant to be. Why we had to do this and why we need to just at least try to understand. Uh, you know, so like I said, hate him or like him. Marquise Morris is now Detroit Piston. Uh, you know what I'm saying? That, that's that's good. I'm, I'm happy about that, man. This guy can even bring us 10 points a game. That's going to help our bench out a lot as a big man, man. Imagine that. If he can give us at least four or five rebounds next year, I mean this season, and 10 points a game. Imagine that. You know what I'm saying? And, and at least be some selectiveness on defense with him and Don out there on the court, man. So, you know, this would be that that would be great. I, I, I'm just happy about that. Uh, so y'all let me know if you like the sign or not. Let me know if you like it or not, man. Just let me know. Uh, can't again be respectful. We, uh, I want some smart answers and reasons why for either side. And uh, subscribe to all the DSA members, man. Links to the channels will be in the description. Uh, it's your boy, Noma J, man. If you haven't had a chance, please hit the sub button for your boy. I really appreciate that. It's Noma J, man. I'm out. Peace.